That was Boot Like Ram Dam Blues, uh, sung by Blind, Le no, not Blind Lemon, Jeff and Blind Lake. And we'll play the introduction slowly as it is tapped out. What's important uh, is the turnaround that you land on your pinky, so you're in position to do that turnaround, which has two nice uh, lines, one ascending and one descending. This goes down and this one goes up. And you can do a lot of variation with that uh, turnaround. I played it with separate uh, strings like the slide of that third finger gives it an extra touch. But you can uh, keep the left hand the same, but um, do something else with your right hand, like... Or... You can really fool around with that. Then the introduction also has a few uh, rolls. Um, second measure, the last beat, it's and the thumb plays the fourth and the third string. Blind Blake does a lot of what they call double thumping and this is my sort of a um, mimicking of that style. And I've indicated in the tap where, if there should be any doubt, where you should use your thumb because it's important. I think that it's, it gives it a nice jumpy and bouncy feeling. Okay, now let's do the verse slowly. once with vocals and I will not sing too hard so you can hear which words are uh, sung at which time. Love my whiskey, crazy about it I can be. Love my whiskey, crazy about it as I can be. solo slowly.
Okay, the first measure is in double time, so it should be played uh, very fast. And also the bass is in is doubled. And then back to normal time. And do a little uh, dynamics here. And the third measure we have uh, in the second beat a very fast um, hammer. Sounds more different than it is, in, but you have to do it in one beat. So if you have the first beat, and then the third beat, and the fourth beat, also one beat. And then we have that uh, in the fifth uh, measure, we have that uh, brush tremolo. So I think you better practice first with your in the index or your middle finger. I prefer the middle finger, some people can do it with the index. Just brush it like this. And when you you can do a steady rhythm, rhythmic brush, try to add with your thumb notes. When you pinch with your thumb, do it like a pinch. When when this no contrary moving, but moving like this towards each other. Now, if you're not able to do that uh, that uh, brush tremolo, then you can go around it and simply play. And I played the fourth bar. Of, uh, variations, rhythmic variations, etc. You can well use your imagination there. And the complete I do sometimes in the song, in the vocal performance, you can hear that the fills of this song uh, are a lot of improvising. And I do a boogie figure. And while doing the brush, I also do it as an, an end tag. It's hard to do slow. <laughs> okay, that takes care of the tremolo brush. And what do we have then? Only I think the 11th measure we have a, a difficult rapid run also, I'll play that. I'll play the 10th measure. slide the third beat it's a slide on the first string to the second and a slight uh, rest and then and the time plays the last notes and you notice that in the vocal performance there's a lot of variation in the in the fills it's impossible to write the, all those out uh, I think if you listen carefully, and you learn the arrangement first as it is written out, and then listen carefully to the vocal performance, you will uh, you will um, be enlightened. I think. Okay, I hope you have fun with this.